What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name's Phil with my lovely co-host, Samantha, and we got some raw tang. I don't know if I'm saying that right on the channel. Raw tang. On the channel for the first time. Also known as the Iron Man, and that's what we're going to refer to him now from now on. And you guys can correct us on the name in the comments down below. We always appreciate Iron Man. Yeah. We always appreciate your insights, guys. They're always fantastic. Yes. So we're checking out somebody new here. Um, I've heard of the, this guy's name before in Muay, Muay Thai, and... I've heard he's, you know, a beast, and uh, I think I've heard somebody like Joe Rogan talk about mm -hmm. him before. Cool. Uh, I follow UFC. We've done UFC videos on the channel before. I follow boxing as well. We've done some boxers on the channel. Mm -hmm. And uh, so I thought, why not check out somebody from another part of the world that's been dominating? Yeah. I th believe in one championship is where he's from. Cool. I think there are some UFC fighters that have come from there. I don't know if Alex Pereira might have been from one oh. championship. Um, but clearly, this is a different weight class. Iron Man, I believe, is the flyweight division. But anyways, we don't know much about him. We're here to learn. I know nothing. And so. uh, you guys can always help us learn by dropping comments down below. You ready to check out some of Rod Tang? I said it again. Iron Man's. <laughs> yes. Most savage moments. <laughs> He's like, nah, I'm coming for you. Does not care. All right, so early impressions on the Iron Man. I can see why he's gotten his name. Well, yeah, and I'm like, is this a sports video or a comedy video? Because I feel <laughs> like it's a little bit of both hybrid here. But um, I don't know much about Muay Thai, like the, the moves that they do and what's cut the kind of the style of fighting. Mm -hmm. So for some of it, I'm kind of like, what is happening? Well, but, I mean, uh, he's you, a beast. You can see, right, as soon as anybody goes to the ground, automatically they're stood up, right? Yeah. So there's no ground fighting. Yes. Um, and uh, I think there's certain moves that you are allowed to do and not like so when he put his hand down and did that and little kick, kick thing i don't think that was a legal move he was um, just showing off yes which is clearly a part of his dna yes. is the showboating aspect yeah well, but, he's doing all these stuff <laughs> but also like not really taunting his like he's taunting his opponent but like not making fun of them so to yeah, speak. you know what i'm saying like, like hit me hit me hit me like, yeah thing. like and that's why i was saying about the iron man yeah right because he clearly doesn't care when he gets hit no and he just he keeps walking it. forward and like let's fight and get yeah. hit and do the thing right? what is this arm thing that i don't know I, i'm not sure about that because i know in other fighting um organizations you can't wear anything like yeah. that. So and in the other video, like his other opponent, the first opponent had something on his arm too. Mm. So I wasn't sure. Yeah, so um he's clearly fun to watch. Yeah. That's for sure. No, 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 no. 
Just walking forward. <laughs> what is happening? That's crazy. Bro, he didn't even move. So you're just shocked, eh, by Iron Man's chin. <laughs> He's got an iron chin. This guy's getting punched in the face and is not even moving a centimeter. You see people get punched in the UFC and they're like, like all over the camera. And this guy's just like, like without moving. Also, he's like punching himself in the face. Yeah, it's interesting. The gloves were a bit bigger in that one. So maybe that, that played a role, but clearly I'm doesn't mind. I'm just so confused. Also, it. what are, they're not really wearing them in this one, but in the last one, they both had two thing on their, things on their feet. I thought you're like, when you fight, you're not supposed to have stuff on your feet. It depends on the type of fight that you're in. I think... Muay Thai, you can wear some in some fights, but um, clearly you were blown away by the Iron Man. <laughs> I just like don't understand. <laughs> well, you have lots of commenters that like, are going to help what? you out. Let's continue. Nasty body kick. That was smooth. Ooh. Ooh, he's getting beat up. You can definitely see the difference like that. He, they're just wearing the small MMA gloves mm -hmm. and the punches are that much harder. You can see when the guy's getting hit, they're really getting hit. Yeah. It's not as much cushioning. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. So um, are you going to want to fight the Iron Man anytime soon? Absolutely not. <laughs> I don't think we, he, he would uh, mind too much because he'd probably just stand there and be like, go ahead, take the best <laughs> shot. I'm not worried. <laughs> scary it's hard to tell like how big he is because some of these people are super tall look compared to him so he yeah. looks like he's short but then like compared to this guy he does he, they're like the same height i'm not sure what fly weight would be um i'm gonna guess like 135 maybe he might be 135 pounds um so he's probably a shorter guy but uh you guys can confirm what yeah. that might be anyways you want to finish it up finish yeah. it up Chop down that tree.
Oh man, he's getting beat up. These guys are throwing. My goodness. I didn't realize how much these guys went in. This is like, the, all of these I feel like are like way more aggressive than half the UFC fights we watch. Half the Maybe time I'm like snoozing during UFC because they're just okay. hugging each they're other. They're not that bad, Samantha. Some of them. Some of them. Um, but I think that's attributed to Iron Man's pressure because we were reading that that's his style of fighting. Literally just is he's always face, walking forward nonstop. and saying, let's just fight, which attributes to a very exciting fight when you yeah. get somebody doing that. So Yeah. I almost I, didn't even recognize him at first with this like fluffy yellow hair. <laughs> Oh, in this last one? Yeah. yeah I was like, wait, where is he? Different hair stuff. So your closing thoughts on Iron Man? He's beast. That's it. That's all Case that we need closed, to say. Stamped and sealed. <laughs> He's a beast. Would you like to see more of Iron Man? Yeah, I think like, I like this. To me, this is more exciting. Like, cause that, like you said, the pressure style of fight. Like This is more of what I would want to watch if people are fighting. She, she just likes to watch people get the snot beat out of them. Yeah, basically. basically. <laughs> She's bored with like regular submissions and knockouts. Now she needs to see everybody getting hit. No, all I the like time. knockouts, but I'm not a huge fan of grappling. Let's just say that. Oh, see, she just hasn't learned the finer arts of grappling yet. Mm. We're working on that, guys. <laughs> but clearly, she likes Iron Man and the kickboxing and the Muay Thai. Yeah, he's um, scary. Yeah, he's uh, clearly got an iron chin mm -hmm. as well. And also got some ferocity in those shots from the legs, the fists. So let us know if there's something else from Raw Tang that we should check out. If you enjoyed this video, yeah. make sure you hit the like button. And make sure you subscribe if you want to check out more content from us. we got music, comedy, sports, and history. So if that's your cup of tea, then you can come <laughs> hang with me and Sam. Yes. Every single day we drop two videos. That's it from us today. We'll be back tomorrow. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you then.